Hello, it is a beautiful day here in Germany. The birds are singing, the sun is shining, and I've been invited to go in there, which is the Ibanez HQ Germany. So I thought I'd take you around and show you all the things that happen in the Ibanez world here. Here's the video studio. There's Dan. Hey, hi, Dan. Hello. Dan, what do you do here at Ibanez? Um, Clean, standing in the showroom. Cleaning, standing. Cleaning, playing, playing the guitar all, all day long. That's, that's basically what we do here. It's like we come to the office and the fir first things first, get coffee and then grab a guitar until like five and then kind of put back in the case and then head home. That's basically, you know, what we do on the... <laughs> Oh God, people hate me. I've just finished playing this in a video. Um, I don't know if you heard, but Dan thinks people are going to hate him for that. He was joking, in case. There was, that was a sarcasm, slash the sarcasm. Uh, this is the GRG 121 SP BMC. Wow, check me out knowing I've been stuff. This is, as you'll see in my video that I've made dedicated to this, one of my favorite guitar releases of the year, and I think it should be one of yours as well. Look how gorgeous that is. But it's also affordable in a good way, and um, and stacked with features. 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 I'm waiting for Jen to arrive. Has she arrived yet? Nope. Dan's just shown me something I've never seen. It. Is this my second time here? Or third? Third, third time here. Yeah. And he was going to show me something that I thought would be a small cupboard with some stuff in it. Turns out it's not a small cupboard. This is the multi-purpose hall, which basically serves for, um, you know, multi-purposes. <laughs> There's a big elephant yeah. in the room. Look at that. Oh my goodness! This Hang is on. an instrument for Andy. Host, can you hold the camera? And I'll Absolutely. Stand there. Look, yeah. That's how big I am. I'm, I'm one meter ninety-three, about six foot four. Yeah. That's a big drum. I could, I could live in that drum. <laughs> yeah. That's a djembe, and but that's a massive djembe. But is it is it a real instrument or is it, uh, is it a promotional you, tool? Yeah, definitely. I mean, who who should you know stand on a ladder and play that? I mean, that's ridiculous. Yeah. Well, okay. You're fair enough. Why, why, why I was even asking? <laughs> um, I want to go around there and tap it on the top. Can I go around there and tap it on the top? Sure. You stay there. <laughs> the other way around. No, 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 no. This way. You go all the way there. I'm so excited. <laughs> Don't destroy anything. I'm not destroying anything. That's a solid tone, right? <laughs> tone for days. Oh, I'm okay. I used to work in factories and things like this in storerooms, and I still did this silly stuff. <laughs> no wonder I don't work there anymore. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Thanks. Dan just found an electric vehicle, so we're driving around on it. Yeah. Whee! Off to Tatooine. <laughs> as long as it's not older on, I don't mind. <laughs> Next stop will be the warehouse. Oh, there's actually a reason for being in this car. I thought yeah. we were just messing about. <laughs> you, you thought you wanted to do a, a vlog or vlog? I did, yeah. So I was like, yeah, let's do the whole tour, all right? Absolutely. We've got to wait for Jen anyways. So where are we heading now? To the warehouse. And QC. And QC. Quality control for those not in the know. Yeah. Hey, hey. Hey Hello. Timothy! How's the hearing? <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Timothy was at the Steve Vai concert last night as well. Yours are not bleeding yet. No, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Timothy, what, what are you doing right now? What are you checking? Actually, I'm unboxing uh, guitars, the startup packs. Uh, checking the guitars and if all the equipment that should be in there is in there. And if something is missing, uh, we just uh, put it in there. Fixing the guitars, straightening the necks out, looking at the frets and everything like that. that cool. What is this one? This one is a... This is a startup uh, IGRJRX 28L Blue. That's a jam pack. Yeah. A jam pack. Okay, yeah. so really important that you get things right on this because yes. it's probably going to a beginner. It's going to beginners probably and we want that they have good proper guitars when they start. I wish we had guitars like this when we started, wouldn't you? Amen, <laughs> amen. And then let's look at the gear you use. Do you mind if I just jump in there? Uh, no, no problem. So you've got the, 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 the Ibanez uh, Tube Screamer amp. Yes. And you've got a Tube Screamer poster 
that I yes. definitely want. <laughs> and then who's this? Living Colour. Oh yeah. <laughs> wow. 2009-2010? Yeah. How long have you been here? Um, I'm here for like a year now, year oh. and a half. And it's really nice here. Nice guys. Good job. Lots of guitars. <laughs> Good. Good to hear. It's really cool here. He's not saying that because I'm standing. No, 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 Dan, no. Dan's got a long stick. He's poking <laughs> him in the back. No, I don't. Right, let's let's leave Timothy alone. Thanks, man. See you yeah. later. Take it easy. Bye, bye. Look at yeah. that. Can I grab it? Oh, oh, what's that, Ali? What guitar is that? My like Jam 70V in C4 Green. What, is it a special edition or is there anything special about it? Oh, it's a premium gem with the Marshall Evolutions and the Edge. You know it's what? one of my favorites. And it would be so much cooler if, if it would be signed by Steve. You know? Yeah, if it was signed by Steve Vai, this it would was, be amazing. Yeah, that was signed by Steve. It's ten times better. Yeah, yeah. You know what? <laughs> What's that, Dan? <laughs> I don't know. Let's look at it. Oh my god! Wow, wow. look at that. Yeah. Proudly manufactured in Indonesia, signed by Steve Vai in Nuremberg. Great. Congratulations, Ollie. Feels like birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Can you show us how you how you usually handle guitar? Like, what's what's the, the steps you do? Sure, try the best. All right. All right. Which one? Show us what we have here. Oh, XPTB. That's a Xiphos seven string. Ooh. So that's a big effing guitar. And it's metal, uh, metal so, AF. Yeah, basically. Yeah. So look at it. these headstocks are everywhere. Oh yeah, Ollie's been really good because yeah, he's got very successful. He's got six, six out of six. That's the rating, Ollie. Six out of the, six. The better you do, the more tuners you get. So six out of six is the highest rating. Yeah. So basically, guitar has been opened. Ollie has the gig bag. He checks it. What's the first thing you look at if you pull out a guitar? Well, the screws. Check all the screws and the. The look, the lacquer yeah. finish, so all the visuals, the like threads, the, and all the other stuff. So all these is meticulously looking after the you know the finish and making sure that there are no dings and dongs because usually at the factory shit. stuff Down. happens. Stuff happens, yeah. Stuff happens, and uh, you know you, you can never be sure that it's hundred percent. So all these taking care of that. So this is a newborn. This is the baby. This is a newborn. This is a newborn. And no one has checked it. So this is an unchecked Cyphos. Well. I would, I would Sorry. say unchecked. I think unchecked. It's, it's been checked at the factory. Unchecked at Minel, I mean. Unchecked at Minel, and you got to say, I mean, these guitars, they, they come across the ocean, so you sure. know, there's a lot of humidity, and it's always a good advice to kind of double check them. That's basically what we do. All right. Okay, and after, if everything's all right with uh, like the visuals, no, no blemishes or anything, what, what's the next step, Oli? Next step is bring the guitar in tune. Okay. And uh, set neck and uh, change the pickup. The height, okay. The height. Okay. And then um, make sure that the guitar stays in tune if you lock the lock nut. Are they, are they, do they come with closed lock nut? Yeah, they're, they're closed. Uh, this is closed now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Good. Well, Excellent. Thanks, Oli. Yeah, thanks so much. Oli has been, has been QCing like thousands of guitars for you guys out there. That's why he's the guitar hero. Check out his Instagram channel, Oli, Oli the Guitar Hero. Yeah, right, that's the Insta. Yeah. There he is. Follow me. See ya. <laughs> Cheers, Oli. Don't fall over, Andy. And voila! Hey, hey! Hey, guys, how are you doing? Great. Nice. We're doing a quick tour. Nice. And we've come to see you. <laughs> Look at that guitar. I wonder who bought this guitar. It's a new one. <laughs> I guess that guy. <laughs> wow. Finally, wow. Oh. So, what's Remember? the story of this one? Yeah, I do. What's the story behind it? I bought it, used, and uh, Oli, basically after work, you know, takes care of these things. I buy him, I buy him a meal every now and then for that services, like the extra mile, <laughs> extra <laughs> hours after work. Yeah, and he was. Look at that. I mean, that looks almost as new. There's some slight yeah. scratches on it, but the fretwork is terrific. Uh, it's set up perfectly. Can't wait to play that. Oh yeah. I can't wait to play that. I guess you can bring that tomorrow back home. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. That will be nice. <laughs> but yeah, there's like another special thing we can take a look at. Like one from the archives. Oh yeah, that's the one yeah. from the minor archives. We have it's a vast like, wow. collection of, of guitars. So. Yeah, the, the JCLG1 NT. 
mm-hmm. like one of the first um, like neck through constructs. Exactly. Yeah. I'd say there's a rare, rare bird. Usually, a, a J Customs don't come in a neck through construction. And uh, it's, how old is it? At like 90, 2009? It's yeah, or, exactly 99. So I did like a nice new thread. Yeah. So Ollie, Ollie, another Ollie. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, he's not just taking care of like special repairs and stuff. He's also taking care that the guitars in the archive are being well maintained because every now and then you got to check them. You know, we've got the guitars from the 70s, 80s, 90s, 2000s, and t- 2010s, and now also 2020s. And we, you know, from every every year we, we keep a couple a couple pieces, the most memorable. And um, yeah, he's making sure that they are ni- kept nice and clean. And oh, yeah. whenever we have some sort of activity. We do some exhibition and show you some of them, not all of them. We got, we got, we got to keep a little bit, you know, hidden. But yeah, that's basically it. And Ollie keeps like so many, many guitars here. Um, let's say five, RG five six five. Oh yeah, that's one of the made, one of the most affordable made in Japan. So a broken string here. Um, they're made in Japan. Nine 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 comes without a case or anything. But that's uh, like for made in Japan. That's an incredible shred machine. And Ollie owns owns himself exactly more of them. Oh my goodness! That's his personal guitar, right? Oh yeah, that's one of my favorites. I got that like 2020 when they first came out. Okay, change pickups? Yes, uh, like the the chopper and the evolution. I mean, evolution for Stevie, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like the easy setup. I mean, especially like the uh, construction here. It's great. It's perfect. Thing. Yeah, uh, it got like a. Bit more resonance, I guess. Yeah. Like that's like how, how Paul Gilbert likes his guitars as well. Right, so square heel and instead of the all axis neck joint. Okay. A little bit more mass, a little bit kind of stiffer construction. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's what people do. They don't what? play guitar all the time. Well, well, yeah. <laughs> okay, I will bring it back. I will go back to work. <laughs> Thanks, Ollie. Oh, sure, you're welcome. Bye. Yeah, well, nice time. You too. Okay, Bye. now now I'm getting a bit hungry. The camera's starting to shake. Okay. We should probably have some food. We should get some food, yeah. I'm not going to vlog that, that's, that's disgusting. Eventually. I'm now joined by Jen Majura. She's arrived, she's well, she's healthy, she's fed. And she's playing her peer. Oh, hello. Beautiful, beautiful. Steve Vai played that last night, didn't he? He did. He did. He grabbed it and he started noodling around and I'm like, oh, he's playing my guitar! He's playing my guitar! And then he said, wow, nice setup. Who feels good. Who did it? And I said, I did it. <laughs> so we're going to make some videos now. So I have to stop this video so I can make another video. <laughs> content. Content, content, content! Two hours later. Just had... Uh, a guitar lesson or two guitar lessons from Jen Majura and I learned a lot. I learned not only the new stuff that Jen has introduced to me, but she also reinforced me as a player and that felt really good that sometimes I don't need to learn new things, I just need to learn that or be told or shown that things that I already know are actually okay. Does that make sense? Is that Does that make me needy? I'm not needy, I just mean that yeah, I was confirmed. Jen's just eyeing up my camera. Look mm. at that, Jen. It's a cool camera. Yeah, look, I can do this. Whoa! Um, it looks a little bit like ET. It does. Right? Like the the the, the head and it's Ouch. like ET. <laughs> we were talking about Jen's song, Testicles. Yes. Which is available to download, and Jen has a very clever way of supporting herself as an artist with this download. Do you want to like explain what okay. you told me? So here's here's the deal. I put out a word puzzle, like a word search puzzle. It's on all my social media and you can find it. And if you are able to find 10 words in that word search puzzle and send them to me to the email that is with the post somewhere, it's jenjenmajura at aol.de. Um, then I'm going to provide you with the link and that's the only way how you can listen to this song because it's not going to be out on Google Play, Amazon Music, Apple Music. It's not going to be available. Your only way to listen to that song is to find the words, solve the word search puzzle and send me an email. And it's, I'm not saying this because you're here. It's really good. 
<laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. You were listening. Oh, what's she listening to? It's good. What is happening? Jen, we're vlogging, yeah. but we okay. should be going live on the Ivanez YouTube channel. Yeah, of course. Ooh. YouTube channel. Ivanez sure Germany subscribe. YouTube. Okay. Yeah. Click, okay. click and subscribe and. Subscribe. <laughs> subscribe. <laughs> Abonnieren. Abonnieren. Hallo Leute. Yeah, all that stuff is going to be in German. Uh, die Kamera müsste dann mal ganz kurz drehen. Ich bin zu sehr drauf und Andy ist yeah. nicht drauf. Hello. So, yeah, sorry. Um, that's the vlog. Um, I'm interrupting logic, logic, logic. things. Stop. Yeah, that's good. Vielleicht mit Mühe reinzoomen. Hello. Hello. Rechts oben ein bisschen bewegen. Geht es? That's German Dan. Hey. German Jen. Und der deutsche Andy. Das ist gut. Und jetzt wieder noch ein Stück zu Andy. Uh. Ah, gele. <laughs> so, sorry, what were you saying? Oh, sorry, I said that your German is really good. Danke schön. Your German is really good, you know? German, your German you, is so good. It's, it's very good German. I had a blast and I was genuinely nervous. Uh, today, oh, no. wasn't nervous during the stream or anything. Um, maybe about what then? About speaking German, I've never done that before. That was my first time. Oh, really? You live like <laughs> here since like for 11 years and you never spoke German on camera. No, that's the first time. Okay. There's the first time. This is the second thing. time. Hello, wie geht's? Es geht gut. Wie geht es dir? Good, thank you. Can you try logging in? Bisschen gut. Okay, I, I've got to log into the Guitar Stories podcast okay, now because okay. we're podcasting later. Because I'm a podcaster and I'm double vlogging. I'm vlogging oh on here goodness. and on this You're one. You're vlogging see? how I'm vlogging. Oh my god. So that's it. Thank you to Dan and Jen and Steve Vai and his whole family for making this all possible. I had a life-changing experience and that's not an overstatement. I hope you enjoyed the video and um, yeah, I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.